Hi, my name's Johnny Austin and I'm an IoT developer in ARM Embed. I've been part of the team working on the BBC Microbit and today we'd like to show you two of our favourite features of the Microbit. The first of these is called an accelerometer which can detect the motion of how the device is moving. And the other feature that we really love is the Bluetooth low energy radio which can send signals wirelessly to phones, tablets and computers that are listening for them. We've put these two things together and this microbit is running a special program that's reading what's on the accelerometer 200 times every second. If I shake this microbit, you can see the motion on the graph behind me. And we thought it'd be really cool to try and use this to teach me to juggle, because I can't juggle at the moment. But I'm not quite ready to drop my microbits all over the floor. So we looked for a juggler inside arm. Simon has two other microbits that are running the same program. And if he starts juggling now, You'll be able to see every time he throws a microbit in the air, there's a peak from the acceleration from his hand. And if you stop for a moment, please, we can see the motion has stopped. And now if you start again, but this time try to throw them higher. Really good. And now stop again. We can see a bigger gap between the peaks. And when he throws it very high, we see a really big peak on the graph. Thanks very much, Simon. Another thing when we were developing these demos was we realized all the different ways that you could apply something which seems relatively simple. I had my microbit on my desk and I was tapping along to the music and I could see the peaks of the bass going along uh, in time with what I was tapping. Well, then we thought, what if you put it on a swing or on a football goal or on a cricket wicket and used it to detect when the ball had hit the wicket or how high the swing was going? We're really excited about all the things you can do and we have no idea what's going to be created with the microbit. And we're looking forward to you guys showing us what this technology can be used for. Thanks.